Hello and welcome to Stardew Valley here on additional Pylons Games. It's going to snow tomorrow, according to the weather report, and spirits are very displeased. They'll do their best to make life difficult for us today. Well, we know one thing we're not going to do today, and that is go over to the Skull Cavern or whatever, because last time it was, yesterday it was difficult as well, and it was an absolute nightmare. <laughs> it was a disaster. <laughs> like those flying dragon thingies attacked me left, right, and center, and it was just... It was horrid. It was pretty much the worst. Okay. We've got some fences that are down again. So we need to take care of those. I got some animals to take care of. Yeah, look at all these. Look at all these fences. Just a mess. There we go. That's a little bit better. Okay, and replace these guys. That was an accident. Whatever. It's fine. Alright, so last time we did finish up our planting here inside look at that everything is nicely watered these sprinklers coming in handy love it it's a bunch of energy that i don't have to expend i like that all right let's go take care uh i realized that i didn't take care of the chickens actually let's uh i guess we'll do the cows first what come on hey there we go all right, I think it's this guy that needs to be milked again. There we go. Got you trapped between me and the heater. That's some milk. A little hay there. All right. Come on, cow. Come on, cow. Out the way. Ooh, worms. A winter root. I'll take it. Some lovely winter music going on here. What? I was literally just out here. How did you break? That was very strange. Very odd indeed. Say hi to our new little chick here. There we are. No, we are not eating the egg. We're going to take this hay, and we're going to feed everybody. There we go. We got some extra, some extra hay up there, I guess. But yeah, it's not the worst, not the worst thing in the world. All right. So, take this milk, put it in the cheese machine. Cheese. All right. And we need to take care of the crab pots down here, lobster pots, whatever. There we are. And soggy newspaper can go up top so that we can use it in the recycler machine. And let's dump off everything we can. Sell. Milk, eggs, winter root, crayfish, periwinkles. Awesome. Good. Good, 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 good. Drop you off here. There we are. So the spirits are not gonna be happy today. So I think that's a cue for us to stay, I don't know. What can we do? Well, I think we need to go into the forest and continue collecting hardwood. That's a big thing. Because we're gonna need that hardwood in order to upgrade stuff here on the farm. So let's go ahead and do that. Man. Anyways, if it's your first time here on the channel, so glad to have you. Welcome to Additional Pylons Games. And, uh, we hope you enjoy your stay. All right. Take care of these. these little guys. Get ourselves some wood. Ooh. Little holly. Little winter root. Little slimes. All right. There we are. Let's get our little sword out here. And, uh, all right. Well, this is looking like a pretty smooth uh, transition through the forest. Oh, 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 okay. There we go. Got him. 
There we are. A little more hardwood. Back to the sword. And we'll take out these guys. There we are. There we are. A little slime for the both of them. From the both of them. Take that clay and let's do some let's do a little bit of fishing while we're here. See if we can catch something other than carp. There's a good chance no, but you never know. I'm not sure what these glowy lights are either. Good. This is looking like a carp. There we go. Which reminds me, last time we unlocked some new crafting recipes. Spinner. The shape of it spins around. Slightly increases the bite rate when fishing. Causes fish to bite faster. What's a trap bobber? Causes fish to escape slower when you aren't reeling them in. Ooh. Okay. Huh. Slightly so increases bite rate. Okay, well, I'm not sure which one of these I want to go for. But we'll give a we'll give it another go here, see if we can't catch something other than a carp in this little lake. If not, then we'll, maybe we'll try the other lake. That's down here in the forest. Nope, looking like it's looking like carp all day. Yeah. All right. Let's go give this other lake a go. Give it a shot, a try. Little slime, you too slow. You can't catch old Jim Bob. All right. Got ourselves some hardwood. Let's check out this lake. Let's see what we can grab. Huh. A broken CD. Cast. Nice. Okay. Nothing doing right now. Just a bunch of junk. Perch. Don't want perch. I need some other kind of lake fish. I need to start working on these these different fishing bundles. Well, it's a, a good sized perch, but uh, river lake. So we need sturgeon and largemouth bass. I'm not really sure when I can get these. Maybe maybe that's the thing. Maybe I just can't get these because they're out of season. Uh, we've also got river fish, catfish, uh, we need sunfish, catfish, and tiger trout. So it seems that winter right now, just because of the whole uh, luck thing, we're doing a lot of fishing at the moment rather than mining. Another perch. Another record perch. Okay. So, it's looking like perch is the uh, specialty fish of the winter when it comes to lakes. Let's go down here to the river real quick. Sorry, little birdies. Chop down a few trees, get ourselves some wood. Kind of doing some general resource gathering here today. Mixed seeds, my favorite. All right. Cleaning up the forest. Let's try that again. Okay. There we are. We'll cut down this last tree and then we'll do some more fishing there. Let's see if we can't find anything new and interesting here on the river. Come on, Jim Bob. Patiently waiting. Got 
Got him. What is it? A pike. Ooh. And we got an achievement. Old Mariner. Freshwater fish that's difficult to catch. I'd say so. Uh, what was that achievement again? Collection Old Mariner. New friend, moving up, treasure trove. 100 fish, Old Mariner. 24 different types of fish, nice. Well, we got ourselves a pike. That's pretty cool. Can we grab ourselves something else? That's a chub. It is something different. I guess I should have specified. Can we get ourselves something that we don't have in our community center collection already? Because if we could, that would be wonderful. Should probably do some research as to when all these fish are actually available throughout the year. Because that's, I think that's actually what's happening is that I'm not catching these fish because I didn't get them in fall, spring, or summer. There we are. Perch and a treasure. What did we get in the treasure? Hey, some coal. That's actually very good. We're low on coal right now, and we need it if we want to make more sprinklers. We need refined quartz. All right. Ah. Well, barely missed out on the treasure. All right. I said we just fish to our heart's content today. See what we can catch here in the river. There we are. Got another treasure, too. Another chub, another treasure. A frozen geode. All right. Something else to bring to Clint. Have them open up. Green algae. King of algae, Jim Bob. Whatever. We were fighting for it. That was probably another pike. It seemed like a similar, uh... Seemed like a similar movement pattern, I guess. But we got one, so... You know, it is what it is. I didn't think that there would be lots of fish outside of the, uh... Ooh. Ah, I, I tried going for it. Whatever. Not a big deal. Wow. That was difficult. Seem to be getting getting hits on our fishing rod left, right, and center right here. Ah. You know what? Here's what we're going to do. We're going to go up and we're going to... Uh, Craft one of those new bobber things. Whatever they're called. Let me give one of those a go. And we'll see if that doesn't help with the old fishing. So, what do we need for... Alright, so, spinner increases the bite rate. Causes your fish to escape slower when you aren't reeling them in. All right, let's go with that. So we need copper and sap. Apparently, I've got the sap, so all we need is a copper bar. Mm, a copper bar. There we go. Why can't I... Do 
This is weird. Why can't I do this? Do I place it? No, it's not looking like it. I'm not really sure what to, why this is not connecting. It seems very strange. All right, my inventory is full. Go ahead and sell off a bunch of stuff. LG can go. The, what else can be sold? Straight up, come on. Joja Cola can be sold. Let's sell the torches, the crocus, into root, holly. Okay, grab the cheese. Grab blackberry jelly. Sell those guys off as well. Let's keep one of these golden perches. For our collection. I think all the other fish we can make into quality fertilizer. We've got one, two, three, four. All right, let's get a little bit more. There we are. All right, quality fertilizer done. Put that in there. Raw resources, let's put all our raw resources in there. Um, you, 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 guys, that stones this is a process this goes into seeds not really sure to do with you guys here we are process you right there broken open okay so why I don't understand why is this not working do I just need to have it in my inventory? And then it works? Bait. Okay. Okay, so that says tackle. Fishing tackle, fishing tackle, bait. All right, let's create one of these spinners and see if, if that does anything. No, again, it doesn't seem to be attaching. Am I doing something wrong here? All right, I'm just gonna have to do my research. I'm not really sure what's going on there. It, it seems like it should, like if I right click, that goes in there. Does this just go, maybe if I just have it in my action bar. Does that help? I'm not sure if this does anything. Max cast. I was too slow on that because I was busy messing around with stuff here in my inventory. I, I'm i just really confused. Another perch. Let's see. Okay. This is going to bother me. Like, why is this not working? <laughs> Do I need to have a better... Do I need to have a different fishing rod in order to attach those? I'm just going to have to do some research between this episode and next episode, I guess. Got him. Another pike. Yeah, take that pike. All right. Uh, oh, that's the other thing though. We do have a magnet. Is that in here? See, that says bait. This is says tackle. Do we need a tackle box? All right, hold on. Let's take a look down here. Spinner, bait. So cooking stuff, gravel path decor. Yeah, this seems like it's, it seems like it's just stuff I need to have in my inventory to work. I don't know if that's correct or not, but that's what it appears to be. Uh, we have five coal. Let's go ahead and process this iron, I guess. Because that seems to be what we have the least of. 
There we are. Do that real quick before dropping it all back off. Let's take our some of our sap as well, and we'll turn all this into quality fertilizer. Uh, let's go down to the dock down here. See if there are any bubbles coming off. No bubbles? That's all right. We'll still cast off the dock. See if we can catch any other types of fish around her. Oh boy. This is looks like another pike and it looks like Are we going to come back from the brink and get him? Got him! Oh, baby! Does that say 51 inch? That's a freaking huge pike! That's a 4 foot 3 inch pike. There we go. And a big bream as well. I'm going to try selling these pike to see how much they sell for. Actually, that's a gold star pike. I'm going to keep that. All right. Perfect perch catch. Another perch. Max cast. Catching fish left, right, and center, guys. Doing all right. I'm definitely going to have to research how these things work. Because that is bothering me. Maybe we, maybe there's a way to earn a tackle box or something like that. And that's what we need. I'll see about that. Alright, this is looking our, like our last cast. There we go. That's a good way to end it. Perfect catch on a bream. Let's uh, drop off this gold star pike. Golden bream two, I guess. Uh, we will sell the pike just to see how much it's worth. We'll sell the LG as well. And then let's make you guys the quality fertilizer. Grab the iron. Let's drop everything off here to your resources and tools. And there we are. Pretty good day. Uh, increase the chance of finding treasures when fishing. However, fish aren't crazy about the taste. All right. I'm, yeah, I really need to know. I want to know about the uh, whole, what these guys are up to. All right. Hopefully, the spirits will be in better favor tomorrow because I would like to do some mining. All right, made a little bit of cash, and I forgot to check on how much money that pike was worth. Silly me, silly Jim Bob. All right, fortune teller, very displeased again, weather report. Beautiful sunny day tomorrow, living off the land. Tell me what you, tell me what's good. There's a couple of fish you can only find in winter, squid and lingcod. Squid can be caught from the ocean in the evening. Lingcod can be found in freshwater all day. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, squid can be caught today. Do we have to get squid for anything? No. Lingcod. Man. Well, I guess today's another day of fishing. Looks like we got ourselves some mail. Come by the shop and check out the new rods. Hey, there we go. They're the best money you can buy and can customize them with different... Thank you, Willy. Thank you for answering the question that I was desperately asking yesterday. Willie, you are... Uh, apparently, you've got a great sense of business. No, don't eat the blackberries. Put them in the jar. Put them in the keg. All right. Willie. Masterful. Just right on time with that... Uh, 
Right on time with that. That business mail there, sir. Let's see how much it takes to get a new rod. All right. So I get newspaper. Let's get you transforming. And then sell all the rest. Nice. Let's uh, hoe up this soil. Get ourselves some clay. Make sure Maggie is watered. And another... One well, of these guys is broken, I think. Yeah. Chickens can't get out anyways, so we're good. All right. There we are. Hey, we got five eggs. You're laying eggs already? That's a little weird, sir. Little strange. All right, we can put you two down here. we are. All set. Here we go. Let's check out the greenhouse. Okay, nothing to be harvested yet. Everything is growing just like it should. Just like we want it to. Get out the milk pail and check on our little little cows. Ooh, Jacardo looks very happy today. All right. I'm going to be squeezing your udders, ladies. Come on. Don't move at me. You know you like it. There we are. I did notice a woodpecker outside. He was on this tree. All right. So this needs to go in the cheese press. And then... We're done on the farm for the day already. So we're going to head on down to Willie's shop. Uh, Riker. I don't know what's... Tell you what. We'll do this. We'll do the large milk in there. And then the rest of this can go in. There we go. Clay goes into raw resources and then we're heading into town. To have, well, okay. Hmm. All right, let's take a look at our tools. All right, so we got steel hoe, scythe. Um. Yeah, no, we're gonna need the money probably to buy a good fishing rod. So, uh, let's put these torches away. All right, so we're gonna have some geodes broken open. We've got a lot of books to read, actually. We're gonna have a lot of books to read in the. Uh, whatchamacallit place. Library. Old Pam Lamb here. So let's head on over to the town. Get these geodes going. Process geodes. What is that? Pyrite. Oh, fake gold. Five iron. I'll take that. What is calcite? Interesting. All right, Clint. Uh, how much is it? To... Oh, 150 for coal. That's all you got. All right. Okay, let's go drop some stuff off here at the library. Because I don't remember pyrite or calcite, and we got at least four books to read. Pyrite. Boom. New reward. Calcite. Nice. Okay. What you got for me, Big Clint? Bear statue? Oh, baby, yes. That is definitely happening. Goblins. The species commonly known as goblins seems to have originated in the forest far northeast beyond the Blue Mire Hills. Characterized by their green skin, bright eyes, foul smell, initial encounters with goblins can be frightening for the unexperienced travelers. Despite their unsettling appearance, goblins are... They're... Okay, so they're like humans. No trouble learning customs and languages. Rather friendly and amiable. Amiable. Uh, unfortunately, centuries of distrust and ill-treatment from humans has led goblins... Has led many goblins to pursue careers in the employ of witches, warlocks, necromancers, and other unsavory types. Uh, grub meat, typically from large and juicy grub varieties. North... Uh, okay. 
indulge in in bludge uh spelling error uh in an item coined as void mayonnaise considered perhaps the finest delicacy in goblin cuisine interesting how do you catch hold on i've already got this one no i already did that one Okay, I already read the thing on goblins. Okay, I already did that one. There we go. What in the world is this? That makes no sense. There we go. Note from Gunther. That's it? Alright. Saw something weird in the tunnel leading out from Pelican Town. There's a little door hidden in the dark. Couldn't get it open, though. Seems that... Hey. Alright, Gunther. Why don't you give me that key to the sewer? And I'll be... On my way. It's been a while since I checked the trash. Okay. So we're going down to Willy's shop. Man. Willy. You were right on time with that, uh... That mail, sir. Some more holly. And I guess maybe what we'll do is we'll end up fishing out in the ocean today. See if we can't catch any good ocean fish. Got ourselves an oyster. Nothing over here. Alright, Big Willy. Show me what you got. Trap pot spinners. Trap bobber. Okay. Lead bobber. Adds weight to your fishing bar, preventing it from bouncing along the bottom. Ooh. Okay. Iridium rod. Ah. Well, let's do it. <laughs> Why not? Uh, we can sell the oyster. We'll recoup some of our costs, I guess. And uh, we'll buy a lead bobber as well. Going all in on this fishing thing. All right. So we're going to take the bait off of that. Fiberglass rod going down. Iridium rod. Even better. All right. So we can fishing tackle, fishing tackle, fishing tackle, and bait. So let's put the bait on there and then tackle. So preventing it from bouncing on the bottom causes fish to escape slower. Uh, we've already got bait on there to increase the uh, fishing rate or the bite rate. So we'll we'll try out the uh, the trap bobber. This can go down here. All right. Let's give this new fishing rod a go. We got some bubbles right over here. So let's uh, let's do that. was easy. Lots of little casts. Getting some good fish hits here from the bubbles. Sea cucumber. That was quite the lively sea cucumber. I've seen sea cucumbers in like those Planet Earth documentaries and stuff. They are not that lively. I also don't think you can really catch them with a... with a fishing rod. Tuna! Ocean fish? Yes! Nice! Okay, so we need red snapper and sardine. Keep fishing these bubbles. Pulling out seaweed. Seaweed central here. My gosh. There we go. Oh, I messed that up. There we go. Sardine. Didn't I need... That's one of the other ones I needed. Wow. Man, this is a good day for fishing, guys. 
Good day for the community center, too. Got them both! A 5-inch sardine, new record, and treasure. What in the world? Bone flute. Alright. Man. We're just gonna keep fishing this spot, guys. These bubbles are... Bubbles are doing us good. Oh, 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 oh. There we are. Another herring. And another fish. What is that? Another tuna! Good, good, good. Guys. Fishmaster Jim Bob here. A new red mullet. Alright, so there goes the bubbles. The bubbles are gone. Another red mullet. Alright. Guys, today's a good day. Alright, let's check over here. Let's get all the uh, coral we can from over here. All right, let's uh, let's do some stream fishing, I guess. Not extreme fishing, just stream fishing. There we go. Another red mullet. Interesting. This would be fresh water, so that means the red mullets have to be able to survive in both fresh and salt water. Interesting. Hmm. Day full of fishing for us here today. Ooh. That trap bobber is definitely having an effect, though. I guess the green bar on the right there is going down much faster. Yep, another tuna. And... Two earth crystals. Okay, I'll take those. So this looks like it's still considered the ocean. Which is kind of strange, considering that it is definitely a stream. Uh, let's try some fishing off the side here. See if there's anything. Anything good in the ocean. I like the, uh, the sound of the waves rolling in. Another red mullet. Red mullets, left, right, and center. All right, Jim Bob. Yeah. Pull in that sea cucumber. My fishing tackle has worn... Oh, it wears out? Oh. Wow. Huh. Okay, so it wears out. Alright, so we need to turn in a tuna and a sardine. Uh, I guess we try putting the spinner on here. Let's... Keep this, uh, keep this fish party rolling. Also, free up an inventory slot, too. Fishing all day and night, boys. All day, all night. Gonna keep on fishing until the, uh, spirits are in good humor again, I guess. And an eight-inch sardine, wow. It's a doozy of a sardine right there, guys.
Yeah, that just wasn't gonna happen for the treasure. That's okay, though. All right. Rolling in the dough here with the fish. I can't remember the last time I did go fishing, actually. Now that I think about it. Uh... Actually, I do think I do know. I think it was for our wedding, our first anniversary? Second anniversary. It's for my, my wife and I, our second anniversary. We went camping. We decided to go camping, because we like to go camping. And uh, we did some fishing while we were there. Yeah, red mullet. I, I'm good for fish. I'm good with fishing for now. Yeah, I think I'm pretty well fished out at the moment. Also, does this show the? Okay, so it does show the life of our tackle. Let's go ahead and turn in a couple more fish at the old uh, community center. Take a look at this quest. Four red slimes deep in the lava caverns of the local mine. Eh. Eh. I don't want to go down in the mines on a super unlucky day. Because we did that in the skull cavern. And it was... It was a nightmare. Those flying dragon things were coming at us all over the place. Alright. Ocean fish bundle. Throw you a tuna. Just need a red snapper. Sardine. We are just one more the uh, red snapper which probably I don't know if it ever fish don't have any of these guys and no sturgeon no largemouth okay good stuff good good stuff let's go back to the farm and uh, wrap it up for the day by wrap it up for the day, I mean we're going to go back there and do a few things here and there. You know, organize ourselves. Sell off a bunch of these fish. And uh, put up our bear statue. Very manly. Very, very manly indeed. I'm happy with... I, I like this. I'm happy with the, uh, the new fishing rod. Cheese, uh, of course. So, ooh, golden cheese. Wow. Uh, we'll keep... I'm just going to try selling the fish and see how much money I make from selling. Holly can go. I can go. That needs to be dropped off. Okay, everything else is raw resource or something like that. Alright. Raw resource. Raw resource. Raw resource. A couple guys go into the green barrel. There and there. And... Golden for keepsies. Our glass rod. We can put that into our tools that go up. Okay, so this red bobber. Alright, that's, that's getting dropped off. This needs to be donated. Alright, in we go. Just real quick. Drop off the fiberglass rod. Thank you for your service. And place the bear statue. Holy cow! Well, let's uh, let's put it right here. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh baby, I like that a lot. All right, so we've got a little bit of time, and we've got a little bit of energy, so we can try. We can do some fishing here on our farm. Let's try fishing up top. I have a feeling that it doesn't make a difference, but. We'll go with it. There we are. Perch! All right. Bouncing all over the place. 
There we go. That was a lot more difficult than it really needed to be. Oh well. Oh well. We're still getting fish. This is looking like another pike. Giving us a good fight. Yeah. It's a small one though. 27 inches. That's almost half the size of the, the massive golden one that we... Our record one. Just a little pike. And by little pike, it's only two feet long. It's only a two foot fish. Fighting for it, guys. Ah, I just lost it. Oh, well. All right. You know what? I'm just done. I'm just done with fishing. I'm done with that. I'm good. Let's go ahead and sell these off. I just, I don't know. I'm done with it. Um, I don't know. Is there anything else we can do? Take a look at our skills. So we're at level eight on mining, forging level nine, fishing level six, combat level seven. Reverse translation and skull key. Okay, so fishing obviously is the one that we're spending the most amount of time trying to level up right now, but we still have a little ways to go on mining. Actually, I'm, I forgot about that. I'm kind of surprised. So uh, I'm thinking that here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna wrap up this episode here. Turn it in early and get a head start on tomorrow. So let's go ahead and see what kind of what kind of fishing. Ooh, 1,701 G's from fishing. Periwinkle snails, crayfish, good. Herring. The sea cucumbers are worth a lot, apparently. The tuna is as well. Red mullets, nice. Pike, 125 for a pike. One pike is worth two perch, basically. Huh. Yeah. Anyways, we made four grand today. Pretty decent. But that's where we're going to wrap up this episode of Stardew Valley. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to hit like and subscribe. Check out some of the other series going on on the channel. And we'll see you next time here on Additional Pylons Games. Thanks for watching Additional Pylons Games. Click one of the boxes to watch another video. And click the circle to subscribe and join the APG Zealots. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and share it with your friends. Comment below and I'll see you next time here on Additional Pylons Games.